What's up guys, this is Sonny and today I'm here with another video. As you can see, finally I'm done building my black and white Hackintosh and I'm loving this. Like, this is one of my favorite build as of now. I love it. I had black and white build, I had all black build, but I can't get over like black and white build. I just find black and white build so beautiful. Like. I'm loving this now as you looking at the system right now that's my everyday workstation that's the system run my YouTube channel I do everything from that computer right here final card Sony Vegas everything I use with this computer now let me just go through the spec real quick so you guys could uh, see what exactly I have and then I'll show you guys how I install Yosemite 10.10.5 now, the reason I didn't go and install El Capitan, El Capitan is not running good with X99 yet. It's not fully supported with X99. It just just don't, don't rush into El Capitan yet. It's not a huge difference between El Capitan and Yosemite 10.10.5. So just relax and you know install Yosemite 10.10.5. I will have an upcoming video a guide showing you how to install El Capitan but for now just stay away from El Capitan it's not running good at all trust me if it did run perfect stable I would definitely make the video but as you guys know any system I built in my channel especially Hackintosh I make sure they run stable before I show you guys and before I you know give you guys any type of guide so first thing first, the case I have is the NZXT H440 and uh, the motherboard I have Asus X99-A motherboard. I love that motherboard. The reason I didn't get Asus Deluxe motherboard, just Wi-Fi and little, you know, that, that, that cover, the white cover goes on the side and I didn't want to spend like 150 more for that. I picked up this motherboard from Newegg for only 200 bucks. So hey, it's a great deal, right? Okay, so the motherboard I have X Asus X99-A motherboard. The CPU I have uh, Intel Core i7-5820K. The RAMs I have Crucial Ballistic 2400-16GB. And the graphic card I'm using for this video right now, EVGA GTX 960 4GB. And the cooler I have uh, H105 uh, liquid cooler and I painted the ring white just so I can match with my system black and white bill and I have two SSDs uh, as you can see uh, Samsung 850 Evo one running Windows 10 and one running uh, USMA 10.10.5 so what else am I missing anything no I'm not missing anything all right so real quick I'll boot the system up and uh, before I do that actually let me just put the system up okay as you can see I recently installed a uh, LED strip right on the top right here and because I, I just wanted to you know like I just wanted to show my setup like how beautiful it looks so it looks really good so as you can see it's boot booting up right now and um, Okay, right here. So let's get in Yosemite 10 10 5 Asus X99-A motherboard. Everything working flawlessly. Everything. Okay, let me just password. All right. Okay, as you can see. And let me show you guys real quick. About here we go. As you can see, Yosemite OS X Yosemite 10.10.5 and then uh, 16GB RAM and NVIDIA G4 GTX 964G. Alright, volume is working. And uh, I'll just put something and show you guys real quick. Graphic is working flawlessly. Internet is working. I have my Ethernet cable on. 
Okay. So I'm not running off Wi-Fi. Also, FaceTime is working. So as you can hear, volume working. Perfect. All right. And um, graphic definitely working perfect. And now let me show you guys uh, the boot flag I had to use. So, if you have an ASUS X99-A motherboard or ASUS Deluxe motherboard, you have to you have to use these three boot flags right here. Okay, the first one is Kix dash dab dash mod equal one, and then make sure you have a space, and then MPCI equal zero X three thousand, then have a space, and then debug equal 0x14e and if you have a 900 series graphic card like I'm using right now 960 I don't have my 970 here, but I'm using my 960 make sure when you're booting up uh, you use this boot flag with this other boot flag uh, nv underscore disable equal 1 and you should boot in and install perfectly and you should be fine now um, that should be it for the part one video I'll have the part two video show you guys step by step for now if any of you stuck and you're trying to install Yosemite uh, uh, OSX Yosemite uh, all you have to do use this boot flag and you should be perfectly fine okay so yeah guys let me know what you guys think and like I said everything running flawlessly there's no issue um, stable i'll have a multi-piece guide for you and some other stuff that i had to do and uh that should be it guys and make sure don't forget to like and subscribe and i just wanted to tell you guys some stuff i picked up three motherboard for you guys gigabyte x99 ud4 motherboard msi x99 ssli plus motherboard and asus x99 dash a motherboard now so just because i can show you guys um you know the guides and all that and we could talk about if you guys have any problem building uh, with any of this motherboard um so first thing first if my video helped you anyway make sure you subscribe like and share the video so you know that will help me run my channel I don't get anything from sponsor I, I don't contact sponsors and all that I, I don't really care about the sponsors and stuff I buy my own stuff I shoot my video with my own money so just help the channel by subscribing liking if my video does help you don't just watch the video and walk away make sure you subscribe make sure you like and make sure you share so you know channel can grow and maybe I'll be I'll be helping you guys a lot more so yeah guys, that should be it. Peace and wait for the part two.